F E1. Also, I brought my rook and rook here stands. Yeah, also I pinned your bishop. Rook E1, A5. Let's try to, to get some counter play here, some counter chances. A5, A4, and maybe Queen A5 then to develop his pieces. Rook E2. What do you think about these two? Why would he be so? Yes. Yeah, just rook e1 I'm trying to get these lines. Rook e2, rook c8, rook e1, queen b7. And now comes very famous combination <laughs> position. Using by using back rank weakness. First move, bishop f6. Bishop takes f6. And now, we have to deflect your queen. If you will do it, then rook e8, we will have a checkmate on the 8th side. We are starting combination by queen g4. Okay. But uh, I don't have to take your queen. Where well, I have to move? I have to move there from where I will defend my rook. The only move is b5. Queen b5. No, no how b5? There is rook. You can't, you can't play there. Queen b5 only move here. And now, if you will take, I will take, and everything is good. How we can deflect now this queen? Very good. Queen c4. Look at this. Yeah, very good. Queen c4. You can take by queen checkmate and by the rook also checkmate. Queen c4. But again, for black, we have we have move, and again we can defend our backhand. How we can play. If you will take this rook, then we have queen c8 check and then rook e8 check. So again, only move here queen d7. What we will do now? Yes. c8. We can capture this one, but then I have rook c8. I have rook c8. So again, our main idea to deflect this queen. How we can do it? Look at this. Move. Queen c7. Again, I'm attacking your queen, and again you can't you can't capture my queen by queen checkmate. Here rook e8, rook c7 also checkmate. Again, you have to play queen b5. What we will do now? Can we take this pawn? Queen takes b7. Looks very good. Because I'm attacking your queen again. Yeah. And uh, again you can capture my queen because of rook e8 we have here. But this move uh, doesn't work here. Now our back rank can be weakness. Queen takes e2. And after rook takes e2 Black has rook c1 check with further checkmate. You see? No, I can't block that checkmate. This is a checkmate. Knight e1, rook takes c1, rook takes c1, oh, and then uh, rook takes c1, checkmate. So be careful, we can't meet this move here. Yeah, I know. Here again, look at this move. A4. Very strong move. 
Again, I'm trying to deflect your queen. Uh, you can take now here, queen e2, rook takes e2. And if you're taking my queen, rook e8. If you're taking my rook, queen c8. So queen e2 here doesn't work. You have to take again this pawn. And what do you think? Why I did this move? Why I need your queen on a4? Yes. If you're playing b3, still I have queen b5. How you will deflect my queen? Eventually. Go back. We played a4 because of now we have rook e4. I'm attacking again your queen. Again you can capture my queen by your rook. We have queen c8. By the queen again we have rook e4. So the only move for you, queen b5. And now, differences between this position, when, when I had my rook here, and this position, that I will take now this pawn, and you don't have queen e2, which you had before. You see that? Very nice. And now queen takes b7, uh, and queen, queen, yeah, queen hasn't any free squares. So if you're moving anywhere, then group E8 check me. You see that? So combination starts from this position.